today I'm filming a glow up video. I haven't filmed one of these in for the ages. Last time I filmed one of these was when my hair was like fully blonde before lockdown. But it's okay because we're going back blonde tomorrow. That's why I'm filming this video. Basically just because I'm getting my hair done and I'm going to try and go as blonde as possible. I'm going to put in my picture of what I want my hair like. And it's another story if my hair actually looks like that because I don't think it will. But this is my hair currently. Awful. You probably can't even see that, it's in a bun. That appointment is tomorrow, so I'm very excited for that. We're also going to be tanning, teeth whitening, eyebrow tinting, lash tinting. I can't get my nails done because of work. My work doesn't allow me to get my nails or eyelashes, so that's really annoying. But that is today, I'm doing another glow up. I'm really excited because I haven't had a glow up in ages. I've been looking like a mole rat for the past two months. Oh yeah, also, about to put in a clip, so roll the clip. And the reason I'm doing this vlog is because it is sponsored by a brand called Just Made Jewelry. I have got some jewelry from them in this package. Yep, my address isn't on that. And I also got my sister a necklace. And I told her that I got her a necklace and she's been very curious where it is ever since. So I'm going to show you what I got and put them on. Oh, the package is so cute. So it comes with a bunch of cards that say handcrafted with love on. So the first thing I got is, this is for my sister, so it's a necklace, there you go, it's her necklace and it says Lucy on, and I got it in silver because I think she wears silver jewellery, that's going to be very awkward if she isn't, if she doesn't, but yeah I got that for her and then I also got, so I mainly got stuff that's like personalised because I liked the personalised things, so the one, the necklace I got for Lucy it was £14 which is actually really good, and it's proper sterling silver, that's so good. And it's personalised, so is it backwards? Oh, there we go. So that's what it looks like. Just has her name on it. I think that's really cute. So we're going to give her that in a minute. And then the next thing I got was something for me. I've seen Sophia and Chintia have these, and I think they're so cute. And I wear gold jewellery. Oh, I love it. Okay, it's, it's a necklace, and it says my name on it, but it's like all different. It's like all different pendants. So I'll put it on to show you. Okay, so here is the next I got. It's gold and it just says Gemma on it. I think that is so cute. And this one was, this one was also 14 pounds. So you can choose whether you get gold, silver or like rose gold and you can choose the material of it and also the length. So yeah, I got this one more shorter. So it's like chokerish. I think that's so cute. So yeah, I got that one. And then, oh, I got a ring. The ring is so cute. Okay, and you can choose the sizes of everything so it's like fits you perfectly. Oh, it's so cute. There you go, this is the ring. I've got everything personalised, it just says gem on it and it's gold. I hate my hands so much. My hands are like my biggest insecurity. But this ring makes them look a bit cuter. My hands are also so pale right now because I have no fake tan on. The ring was also £14. You can pick like silver, gold, rose gold, whatever you want. So yeah, I think they're so cute, you can just get your name on it. I thought also think it's really good for like a gift idea, if it's your friend's birthday, you could get them a ring with their name on. Or your boyfriend, I think boys with jewellery on is really cute as well. But the last thing I got was something, I got it matching with Lucy, but mine's in gold. So yeah, I got the same as Lucy, but it's just gold, it says Gemma on it. I'll put it on. There's literally so many options, like from colours, to length, to sizes, to designs. Like there's so many different designs. Of these necklaces like different fonts i think mine and lucy's fonts are actually different i can't really remember there you go so it's that it says gemma on it with my ring so cute i actually love them no this one was 18 pounds adorable oh is it a necklace yeah that's so cute oh what's the brand i got you silver because you wear silver don't you yeah, I don't mind silver or gold. I it's from Jessmine. Is this yours? Yeah, and I got this one. That's cute. And this ring. Oh, oh, that's cute. I like that. That's what the silver one looks like, and this is the gold one. So you prefer silver so or gold? Proper yellow gold. Or it? So you get silver gold, and they also do rose gold. So yeah, that is all of the jewellery. Thanks Just Made for sponsoring this part of the video. I love my jewellery, and you can all go get your jewellery so you can be matching with me. Right now I'm gonna go and have a shower and fake tan and I'll show you my fake tan routine because I've had some questions on my fake tan routine. Do not know why because 
my tan literally goes awful every time I put it on. My hands go orange every time, but I've kind of learned a tactic of how to not make your hands go orange. I'm really excited to get my hair done. That's the thing I'm most excited for because I just want to be back blonde. Because if you look at me like this, I just look brown. I'm gonna have a shower now. Shower transition. I've put my tan on and I've got my pajamas on. Just waiting for my tan to dry and I've put on my top and it's very creased. But this top's from Primark, it's actually like the best thing ever. They're kind of going viral on TikTok. I've had this for ages, so trends are. But it's really good because it has like a bra underneath it. Like it's got like a built-in bra. It's like the comfiest thing to sleep in. So highly recommend everyone goes get these. And they have them so many different colours now. I want the pink one. I'm gonna go now sleep and marinate my tan and then I'll see you all in the morning when my hair appointment when I'm going to my hair appointment. I've got a driving lesson before my hair appointment, so See you after that i guess hi i'm home from my driving lesson i drove all by myself but i got beeped at so <laughs> really great i'm gonna go for my hair appointment at half 11. i think it's like quarter to 11 right now so gonna get ready and then we can go i'm gonna tint my eyebrows right now because they're looking very bad so what i use to tint my eyebrows is i use this this thing it says lotus by salons direct in the shade brown and then this is the developer. So we're gonna do that, but we're gonna put one centimeter of dye into the little, it's like an, it's like an eyelash thing, that much. And then we'll put like three drops of the solution into it. And then get the brush to mix it. That is one eyebrow tinted. It's obviously not been rubbed off yet. I'll rub it off in like 10 minutes. Okay, my eyebrows are done. Now I'm gonna do my eyelashes because my eyelashes are non-existent. Done. My eyelashes and eyebrows are tinted. Oh my god, my my desk is actually ruined from my eyebrow tint. But can you see all the little brown stains? Yeah, not good. So I'm gonna leave these on for like probably about 15 minutes. Looking cute. I need some lip balm. This is my favourite lip mask. It kind of smells disgusting. This does. It's meant to be. I don't even know what it's supposed to be. It smells like. I don't like the smell of it, not good lie, but it's really good for your lips, so I'm alright with the smell if it's good for my lips. I want Olivia Neal's nipple balm, you know the one that she uses, I'm gonna buy that, I don't know what it is though. But when I get home from my hair appointment, I'm gonna whiten my teeth. What I use to whiten my teeth, it's this stuff, wait, <laughs> it's the Smile Kit, Smile Now Teeth Whitening, and it comes with three like injection type things, I'm like almost run out of one of them and a little mouth thingy and then like an led light so you attach that to that obviously and you like inject the gel into the what's that the silicone thingy and yeah and you get this little whitening card i don't know what mine mine are probably like six I don't know. But that's what I use if anybody wants to know. But shall I do before of my hair? So this is my hair from the front. Before. I'm going to get it cut as well. Because I literally haven't had my hair cut in months. Since December. December, like the beginning of December was the last time I had my hair done. So this is the front of it. There you go. Sides. And my hair's not even that bad, but the back. If you look at the back. Awful. Can you see? That's the back. Can you even see it? Yeah, so that is my bonnet. Just putting my other rings on. These are the rings I wear every day. And these are, this is the necklaces I wear every day. And then I have resin rings, but I lost them. They were too big for my fingers and they fell off. So that's really sad. That is very sad. Hairdresser lighting is also like the worst lighting in the world. I hate, because he was sitting there staring in a mirror for like four hours straight. So that's just the worst thing ever. I hate it. And we're done. This is the attire for the hairdressers. I'll be back when my eyebrows and eyelashes are rubbed off. These are my eyebrows and eyelashes. I took it off and they're very natural. Because that's how I like them. Now I'm going to go to my hair appointment. So I'll be back when my hair's done. I, I think know if you brushed it with that, with that toner. 
come out. It's actually awful. Jenna, I think you put coconut oil in it and wash it. Okay. They would sort it out for you and they would make it more blonder. I'm not going back. It's embarrassing. That you can't. Because I, I was sitting there doing my hair fine. Yeah, your hair doesn't look bad, but... Can we just go back in time? Oh, it's the haircut. Like, how long is this going to take to grow out? Bloody ages. ages. I mean, it's funny. I'd literally be in my eyes. Yeah, I'm trying not to cry. Oh my god, it's literally stripes. It's stripes, purple, yellow, really? green. Oh, yeah. This is supposed to be a glow video and look at my hair. And I tried to have curtain bangs. You all saw the photo that I wanted. And they're literally just like... I feel like they look better if you washed your hair. Because it might take the natural wave of your hair. I'm going to wash it. I'm going to wash my hair and try and fix it. I actually can't. I actually don't, I don't think I've ever looked worse. Like, this is supposed to be all like... What's it called? Blended. <laughs> look at that. That's actually stripes. Why is it? Why do I look like my granddad? I think I've grew some lady balls. Stopped crying. And I've been and washed my hair, put coconut oil in it, and I've washed my hair. And I'll show you what it looks like now. It still looks awful. Like, it's still terrible. And I've booked in a different hair salon to get it fixed. That's in two weeks' time. I'll show you. I just can't even, it's not even, it doesn't even look blonde, it literally just looks grey in these front bits. I don't understand how, how has that happened? It's so short, look how short it is. They don't look the worst when they're like, swooped, I just don't, I just hate how short my hair is as well, like I want extensions now, and it's not even blonde, and like my hair isn't even blonde, it's literally grey. <laughs> I don't understand. This was meant to be a glow up. I feel so bad because the hairdresser was so nice. Some of you are probably going to think it doesn't even look bad, but just think about the photo that I asked for. Like, I'll put the photo in what I asked for, and this is what I got. Do you know what I mean? I don't want to sound ungrateful or anything, but I just really hate it. I just wish I stayed how I was before. What the F? I have... <laughs> Tell me some hair growing tips, and I'm going to get some castor oil and try and make it grow. Because I just hate how short my hair is. I wanted long blonde surfer girl hair just to live my best hot girl summer and this is what I've landed. This is not blonde hot girl summer surfer girl hair. I'm going to go and do some online shopping now to try and cure my sadness. I'm going to order loads of clothes and try and make myself... It's, I'm going to try and glow up fashionably rather than face and hair type thing. I'm going to try and glow up in my fashion so that when I go to school... People will think, ah, oh, she's got a cool outfit on, and not even look at how bad my hair looks. So I'm about to spend £27 on a hoodie and castor oil. I'm going to get the grey hoodie. Yeah. Okay. okay, the castor oil says it's for hair growth, and I'm going to get the hoodie as well. I'm going to press buy now. This may cure my sadness. I put my hair in a roller, because my sister told me to. I've just been on the phone to my sister, and she said to put it in a roller, so... I put it in a roller. Can you actually see how many different colours are in it though? I don't understand. I look like a rainbow. Like a silver rainbow. Yay! Yay! Guys, I think I fixed it. I don't think this looks that bad. Do you think I fixed it? I think I rolled them the wrong way. I don't know. Do you think they rolled like weirdly? This is it now. Low key fix. I think if I did my makeup, I'm going to do like, I'm going to show you the makeup that I want to do. I found this girl on TikTok and her makeup was so nice. And that's what I planned on doing today when I got back from the hairdresser, doing my makeup like that. I'm feeling really pretty, but it just went the other way. That's the kind of eyes I want to do. That whole makeup is how I want to do my makeup. So that's what I'm going to try and attempt to do tomorrow. But for the time being, I don't think they look that bad. Like now they're styled in like rollers and I haven't put any heat in them. And I didn't want to put any heat in my hair because my hair would just get damaged if I put heat in it. I'm just really sad about the colour because I wanted like platinum, like that colour, the picture I had. I wanted it to be bright blonde, like proper blonde, but I feel like my hair looks brown. The bangs look better now that I've styled them. Like they definitely look better now. I, I do feel like I look quite trendy. I don't think it looks all that bad. I feel like I look like a different person though. 
But what do you think? Let me know. I'm gonna go and watch Mamma Mia and eat egg and spoon and ready sorted crisps for the rest of the night. Good morning. We just this is what I've been doing since last night, just trying to get it out of my face. My outfit, I've got this top from Sheen. It's like all backless. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't attractive. Um jewelry's the same, Jess made, Vivian Westwood. This isn't backwards, because when you look at me, it looks backwards. Like, when I'm looking in the mirror it looks backwards but when someone's looking at me it's the right way does that make sense? and then I've got these jeans on these are the jeans, they're from Topshop there's like baggy blue jeans and that's the back of the top and my, it really shows my nice tan that I did ready for my new hair which didn't work when I get back I'm going to do my makeup how that TikTok was because I really want to do that makeup and I think it will look cute in my outfit but I'm going out just like shopping in this place called Rushton so when I get back, I'm going to do my makeup and try and style my hair. I just really don't want to put heat on it because I've already had bleach on it, obviously. And when I go and get it fixed at this other hair salon, they're probably going to have to put more bleach on it. To, like, get rid of all the stripes. If you see any future videos of my hair looking like this, just pretend it's not there. I'll be back when I'm, when I'm back from shopping and then I'm going to do my makeup. Hi, friends. So, I did my makeup. This is how I did it. I kind of did the black eyeliner around my eyes. Bit of eyeliner going on and I put on my green Ayats Franz jacket with my Zara top. I got these joggers from Primark today. Really cute. I also got some pajama shorts. Primark pajama shorts are just the best. Like these ones. Oh, these ones are so cute. So yeah I got pajama shorts and joggers. That's all I brought in town. But back to the hair because all I talk about is my hair but um, I just can't stop banging on about it. I, don't, oh, I keep falling over as well. I hate it still. Like, I really, really, really hate it. I have just almost cried for like an hour. I had to sit in my bed and restrain myself from crying because I hate it. I don't know if it's my makeup because I've done my makeup different. I probably was a wrong move doing my makeup different and having different hair because it's just a bit too overwhelming all at once. But here we are now. But this is the hair. I hate it still. My friends say that I look cool, but I think I look awful. It's just so different and oh, I, just, I still hate it. Moral of the story, I hate it. I quite, I quite like my little green outfit. My green jacket and top. Obviously, I'm not going to wear the joggers out. But yeah, I'm going to end this video here. It wasn't a glow up. I'm really sorry for the let down. I don't really know what else to say. It's a fat let down. Really sorry. Stay on this space for in two weeks time when my hair looks how I actually want it to look like for like that photo but for the time being just pretend you don't see my hair in my videos okay thank you so much for watching subscribe for the pain that I went through and I'll see you in my next video ciao bye